Yo, what's up guys, this is Fade, and today I'm going to be talking about some stuff going on with Warface. So, first thing I want to get into is Warface is getting a new publisher. Yeah, I was very surprised, not really, but I, I was surprised that it actually did happen because all I've really heard were um, rumors and I couldn't tell if it was true or not. So, they officially announced it on the forums yesterday that... It's getting a new publisher, my.com, also known as mail.ru. They own the RU server. And I think they're going to be able to do a better job taking care of Warface, NA, EU, Turkey, better than Crytek. I'm not bashing Crytek, but I just feel like since mail.ru already own like the most successful server, which is RU, it's Warface in Russia. Is one of the biggest games so I consider a very very successful game they have the money they have everything so I feel like they're going to be able to fix the problems that Crytek couldn't I'm looking forward to, uh, to the game how it's gonna be after mel.ru officially take over and and start changing the servers and start making some changes so um yeah good thing good things coming to Warface a lot of people had some questions i know i did i i had a bunch of questions and uh i'm just gonna put i, I don't want to like make this video extra lengthy and go over every question that i had not answer it so they they answered a bunch of questions on the forum on the faq i'm just gonna link it down in the description i'm gonna put it first thing in the description just check it out if you have any questions okay so the second thing i want to talk about is esl and i know some of you are gonna pause the video fade i don't want to play esl because there's no point of it we're not gonna place first place team is always gonna get first place but just listen to what I have to say it's not about getting first place second or third it's just about you becoming better as a team learning to play with each other learning how to improve your mistakes and not make them again it's about your progression from when you first started to where you are now and it's really just gonna help you because when you're playing against other teams that are very good you're gonna make a lot of mistakes and you can just learn to improve those mistakes that way the next ESL you can do better and, and maybe even place maybe even get first second or third so I just wanted to put it out there that that does not matter you placing nobody's gonna judge you for not it's really just about becoming better and having this whole competitive edge on NA. I mean, not everybody is good. Even the first place teams, they practice a lot too. They don't just sit around because there really is no limit to how good you can become. It's you can always become better. You know, these first place teams, they make mistakes too. So it's just really all a learning experience and becoming better. Even my team, we, we're still practicing to this day, just uh, re-watching our mistakes and really just trying to become better as a team. So... I will put the descript the link of the ESL website on the description if you want to check it out. So what you need to do is basically get four more players, so five in total, and just sign up on the ESL website, which there will be a link on this description of the video, and just um, practice with your team with the ESL Open Cup rule set. That's the current rule set that the ESL is going to be. It's going to be on February 4th. Which is like in two weeks, so you have a lot of time to practice with your team. Achievements do go to the top three placing teams. First place get 3,000 credits in the gold ESL stripe. Second place get 2,000 credits per member and the silver ESL stripe. And third place get the bronze ESL stripe and 1,000 credits per member. It's not about the rewards, it's not about getting first, second, or third. I mean, of course, you gotta strive to get first, but if you don't, it's really just about trying to become better. It's just this whole fun experience you can have with your team. And I really, really, really do recommend signing up. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Peace out.